State Farm is in legal trouble tonight. The insurance company accused by several states of not paying enough to fix cars involved in accidents. So is State Farm lowballing repair costs to save money and putting us all at risk? With us now, Rebecca Legrand with the Kaiser Law Firm and Eric Guster, who is a criminal defense and civil rights lawyer. Eric, I'll start with you. You're on, with me on set here. What do you make of, of these lawsuits? These lawsuits are extremely valid because State Farm is not being, uh, not being a good neighbor in this situation. Because what State Farm does, they lowball these auto repair companies. They get them to use uh, insufficient parts, old parts, scrapyard parts, and that's not fair to the consumer right. who depends on their car to get them from point A to point B safely. Work, school, you name it. Exactly. Rebecca, do you so State Farm, Eric, is saying that all the repairs it pays for are up to standards, that they're doing what they should. What's going to be the outcome for consumers, in your view? Consumers don't save money based upon this. This is all about State Farm protecting their bottom line for their investors, for their chairman of the board. They want that bottom line to be huge, and that is what the problem is. They're not looking to lower costs because insurance costs have actually gone up, almost doubled over the last few years. So State Farm and other insurance companies who are lining up behind them because they're the largest, they're not protecting consumers. They're just doing something to increase their bottom line. Not Rebecca, sure why. Uh, are consumers being fairly represented by their insurance companies in your view? In, in some cases, no, because the insurance company's job is to make money because they, they really care about their bottom line. And this is evidence of it. When the person is in a car wreck and the insurance company, they, they're not reducing premiums. They're not uh, saving you money off of how much you have to pay every month, but they want you to use cheap old used parts that's not fair to a consumer out there, rebecca and eric thanks for coming on the show tonight great to see both of you thank you